welcome to Texas A&M for the first ever uh, college tournament here in uh, in Texas, in the South, um, in the US, in fact. Um, I'm here with the uh, the president of the USAFL, Dennis Ryan. Uh, come on over, Dennis. Um, basically, going to ask a few questions and find out what we thought of today's uh, tournament effort. Uh, Dennis, how do you think things went today? Uh, you know, considering how bad the weather had, uh, was today, uh, we're pretty probably probably pretty lucky. There's a lot of it. Uh, scooting by either side of us and uh, it didn't really get bad until halfway through the, uh, the actual final. So, um, and considering how bad the rain has been uh, everywhere else around in this area, uh, I thought we were extremely lucky from a, a weather perspective and I couldn't be happier with uh, the feedback from the players, how, how much they enjoyed it, the, the, the spirit it was played in, they played in a fantastic spirit. Um, I was a little bit worried you know, always when the uh, Guys don't have that much experience at the moment. Go for the player and instead of the ball. But their, their attack on the field was fantastic. They certainly uh, respected each other and um, you know, nobody got injured, so nothing to worry about from that respect. So, so, can you tell us who we had out here today? Uh, we ended up having um, uh, 16 guys come down from uh, Lubbock, Texas, Texas Tech. Uh, we had uh, the Aggies, AM had a team. Uh, UT ended up uh, joining teams with uh, LSU and the um, University of Houston also had a team. Right, and um, the format was each team played each other basically? Yeah, so in the end we went with the four, four uh, team uh, format where basically everybody, the four from uh, each played each other to uh, all in uh, uh, 15 minute half games, so just quick little games, uh, but they all got three games in. And what about the, um, you know, the way the game was played in terms of you know, new players never having played before? What, what was your observation of how, how well they adapted to it? I was pretty impressed. There's some guys out there and obviously got some really good skills. It's some, some, obviously some uh, quite funny things happened. Uh, that's this, some of the games. One guy got a handball, the ball to him, standing in the goal square and kicked it back to the guy who, who uh, handballed it to him instead of kicking, turning around and kicking a goal. Um, so there's some little funny things like that, but... In general, the skills were, and just the, the knowledge of uh, how to run the ball down the ground. Uh, there's a, a lot of handball because they're a bit, um, I guess, reticent to kick, having, having uh, not done that skill much before and having a bit of difficulty with it. With it. But uh, certainly, the way they uh, laterally moved and walked around players, some of that was fantastic. Um, just, just the, obviously, not having much knowledge of the game. There was some, and, and, and now that this has uh, happened and, and you know, you've, you've called it a success, what does this mean for, for college footy going forward and, and the USA's uh, you know, essentially journey towards becoming a you know, popular football country? Well, so the next step for us is uh, next spring, we uh, continue to have some more tournaments. Uh, there's enough, obviously, enough teams in Texas to actually get the moment away. Set up. Uh, so we'll go for some more tournaments next, next spring, get some more teams like um, build up on the numbers that they have in the UTs and the LSU, we might have a number of teams. So we'll build up. Now that, they know, now that they know something is there, they, uh, and, and that there's other teams that actually are interested and there is students that they're going to play against, I think we'll be able to help, help those clubs. Colleges will build up their own teams, and we'll have a four, by next four we can have on our Texas competition. Yeah, absolutely. Well, mate, congratulations on putting on the right event. Uh, I think it was successful. The weather's tried to beat us down. Yeah, but we, 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 we prevailed. I think we overcame, uh, yeah. Yeah, the grand final was played against uh, between uh, Texas A&M and uh, Texas Tech, and ended up being a draw, three goals, two, 20 each. At half time, the game had to be abandoned due to lightning, but uh, fantastic skill level. Yeah. Great work. It was probably, at the end of the day, it's probably a, uh, an appropriate result. Absolutely. Um, Glad to good spirits. Yeah, exactly. All right, mate, well, I'd like to ask uh, Benny Carpenter to come over.